to know where the treetops glisten and children listen to hear sleigh bells in the snow. Sing, Caleb. a white Christmas how many you love the snow come on get your hands up if you are a snow person my wife loves snow I want to move to Hawaii <laughs> but yeah just Orlando okay Orlando's my place uh, snow I, I'm like why do you like the snow why are we dreaming of a white Christmas why do we want the snow is it because we love driving in it not you guys. Nashville traffic in the snow is some of the craziest traffic I've ever seen. We hear that one little flake's going to fall and there's not an egg one left in Walmart. <laughs> you want a loaf of bread, you better go before they say it's going to snow. Because you guys go nuts. So do you like the snow because of that? No. No. Why do we want to like the snow? Oh, oh, we want a white Christmas because we're going to get out of school. School day, snow, it's, ah, oh, yeah, wait, wait, no, no, we're already out of school for Christmas. So what is it about snow? What is it? I asked Mr. Caleb to come up and help me. He's my uh, prop today. Just hold that real careful there, Mr. Caleb. You just hold that for a moment or two. What is it about snow? What is it about snow? It, it, it's cold. I don't like to be cold. How many of y'all like to be cold? You like to be cold? Not me. Me and my wife have arguments over the thermostat. I'm like laying in bed with blankets this deep, and she's like, oh, good Lord. What is it about the snow? What is it about this white stuff right here? I mean, what? Oh, we're going to go out and we're going to play and we're going to make snowballs. <laughs> what is this about snow? Well, I got to thinking about it. The only thing I can figure that makes the white Christmas, that makes the snow so important, is the way it looks. We want to look outside and we want to see that white snow. We want to see the treetops glisten. We want to hear the jingle bells. We want to see it pretty out there. Why? Because if you look out that window right now, it's not pretty out there. There's not a leaf on the trees. The grass is brown. And because of last night, there's tree branches everywhere. So why do we want the snow? Because that white, gorgeous snow comes and it falls and it covers all that dark, icky death of winter up. It makes it gorgeous. It makes it pretty. The snow comes, and I'm dreaming of a white Christmas because of this. I want to read you this. Isaiah 118 says, Come now, let us reason together, saith the Lord. Though your sins be as scarlet. Help you with that a second. Though your sins be as scarlet. And get your attention over here to the Giant test tube of doom. Am I hearing uh-ohs out there? <laughs> Do 
Do not try this at home. Try it at Ed's home. <laughs> Though our sins be as scarlet. Though our sins be as scarlet. The, the word tells us that, that in the beginning God said, let there be light. And there was light. But then darkness came into the world through our rebellion, through our sin. Then he sent Jesus, who was the light of the world. He said, let there be light again. Then Jesus said to us, hey, I want you to be the light. You're the light of the world. Though your sins be as scarlet, God said, God said, <laughs> I'm dreaming of a white Christmas. He's looking for your sins, though they be scarlet, to be white as snow. He wants to come in and wash you clean and wash you pure through the blood of the Son of the one and only God. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas. Thank you, Caleb. <laughs> 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 <laughs>